Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is going to be a little shorter, a little more concise, but um, I just wanted to show you some new items that I've got for vet school. So I thought I'll do an unboxing and show you guys the new items. Before we get into the unboxing, Please do follow me on my Instagram. Comment down below any other video suggestions that you have or anything you'd like to see. Like this video and subscribe to my channel. So the first item, it's very, very exciting. I've been waiting for third year to get this item. My first ever stethoscope. So this is the box that it comes in. And I got the Littman Classic 3 stethoscope, which is what is recommended for your third year. And I decided to get the chocolate brown color with the bronze finishing. And now I'm just gonna open it. I have already opened this and seen it because I had to check that the stethoscope is all good um, before I purchase it. But when you open it, here it is. It's a chocolate brown stethoscope with a bronze copper finishing. So pretty. This is the stethoscope. I love the finishing. And it's a chocolate brown color, as you can see. And then this is obviously the main side that will be used. And then this is for pediatrics and smaller animals. Um, but yeah, you can turn it. I just love this color, this finishing. It's definitely my aesthetic. It's so, so pretty. I'm gonna put it around me like this and walk around. <laughs> but yeah, I think it's really, really pretty. Um, I've been wanting this color for a while now. I'm really, really happy with it. These stethoscopes do come in different colors. They come in green, purple, blue, pink, uh, different shades of blue, black brown, gray. So they come in a lot of different colors um, and you can definitely check out the Littman stethoscope website online. You can see the different colors. Uh, but yeah, it also comes with some extra ear pieces and rubbers for the stethoscope and a little manual which just has ways to use it and all sorts of things. So I definitely am gonna end up buying a case for my stethoscope just because I don't wanna like throw my stethoscope in my bag um, or tangled up. We have our clinical exams, um, clinical exam practicals this semester where we basically practice our clinical exam skills on different species. We just recently finished our sheep clinical exam practical um, and for all of those we need a stethoscope so that's why it's necessary for third year to have a stethoscope also we are learning a lot about uh, cardiovascular pathology cardiovascular medicine and pharmacology so it's definitely very important for that because you need to understand everything about the heart and you have to understand different types of murmurs, heart murmurs that you can hear and the different grades of murmurs. So for all of that, you'd need a stethoscope. Yeah, so that's the first unboxing. The second one, I haven't opened yet. It's still taped and sealed. It is a suture kit. So the reason I got this suture kit is because in exactly one year's time, I'm gonna be performing my first live surgery in fourth year. That's when we perform our first live surgery and we did learn some suturing techniques in first year and we are going to get a revision in third year but i think it's really important to practice your suturing skills because as a fourth year vet student you're going to go into your first ever live surgery and you need to know your suturing techniques because the surgeon is going to be busy teaching you how to do the surgery and if you don't know your suturing techniques and you're going to go in there blind um, then the surgeon is going to be busy teaching you how to suture and you won't really learn much about the surgery itself 
So it's always good to go in prepared. It's also obviously really unfair for your patient if you go unprepared because that's their life on the line. So it's really important to have practice and third year I intend to do as much suturing practice as I can just in my free time whenever I'm in my room while I'm watching a Netflix show. Um, I think it's important to make it into muscle memory and just remember all the different kind of suturing styles that you need to perform. So anyways, I just opened it. Um, this is the front. Uh, I have ordered this from Amazon. It's called Medical Pro. Yeah, Medical Pro. I don't know if you can see it, but and there's like this little card. And here it's the kit. Okay, so they've given us scalpels and surgical blades, many of them. We have all of these different items for suturing. We've got some forceps and we've got needle holders, scissors, everything you need to practice suturing. And then in this pouch, we're gonna check out what's in this pouch. So in this pouch, we have many, many different types of needles and threads. So we've got uh, nylon monofilament here. Um, and we've got polyester braided. So we've got many different types um, and sizes. So obviously with horses, you will use something different with dogs and cats you would use something different so just all of these different types of needles basically we've got 32 different types of needles and threads in here so that's a lot and now we're gonna get this out so this is the suture practicing skin so it's like jelly and these are different surgical cuts and I can practice my suturing on this little thing. I don't know if you can tell but the material is very soft. It's supposed to mimic the pressure of skin when you put the needle in. I think it's really convenient to have a pouch like this because I can even take this to campus and practice my suturing in the library for a few hours and I don't want to study. It's always a good idea to just practice suturing while you're watching a show or anything like that. Um, so I think it's really, really useful. These are obviously very, very sharp and dangerous to have. So I'm going to make sure that they are in a safe place. But yeah, this is the whole suture kit. The suturing pad, all the needles and thread um, and all the Equipment like forceps, needle holders, scissors, everything's here. This was my little unboxing video of my stethoscope and my suture kit. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I will definitely be making more vlogs because I know a lot of you enjoy those videos. So I'll probably end up doing a vlog for next week. But for this week, I thought I'll just do a sit down and do a little unboxing. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um, make sure to subscribe, like, comment, um, and follow me on my Instagram. Bye.